Have you ever wondered why time seems to fly by when you're having fun, but drags on when you're feeling bored? And what if I told you that your experience of time speeding up or slowing down reveals a hidden truth about its nature and how it's intertwined with your personal consciousness? And what if you could receive a message from your future self explaining how you can harness time and its connection to your consciousness and learn how to jump through dimensions and manifest your deepest desires instantly? Imagine the possibility that your future self, another version of you, has mastered the art of time navigation and how to maneuver through the landscape of existence itself. This is the point in what you might refer to as time for you to learn how to access the same mastery. It's a call to action from another version of you urging you to start embracing these principles now to unlock your full potential and begin living a life beyond the conventional boundaries of time and space. This isn't only about foreseeing the future, it's about creating it with your mind and your intention in our everyday lives. Time appears to be a constant, ever-flowing force that marches from one moment to the next in a linear fashion. But imagine if time was not just a sequence of ticking seconds, but a landscape that we could navigate in any direction forward, backward, and even sideways to access any point in space that we desire at any present moment and actively shape our own reality. Time is actually only an illusion designed by our own perceptions and shaped by our thoughts in this video, guided by the wisdom of another version of you, and the understanding that all things are interconnected and that all consciousness is now, will explore how embracing the expansive view of yourself as the universe itself can unlock extraordinary powers of manifestation and transformation. Get ready to see time, not as a limitation, but as the ultimate tool for creating the life that you've always imagined. This is an invitation to step into a realm of limitless, possibilities where time bends to your will and your deepest desires manifest with ease. Time as we experience it is not a fundamental aspect of the universe, but rather a construct of our individual perceptions and illusion. If you will imagine time not as a linear path that we travel, but as a vast ocean in which all moments past, present, and future exist simultaneously, this ocean of time is not something that we move through but rather something that we are immersed in with different moments, becoming prominent based on the focus of our conscious awareness. There are other versions of you who understand this concept deeply, and when you begin to perceive time from this expanded viewpoint, you unlock the ability to consciously choose which aspects of time to experience and when, but if time is only an illusion. How do we use this concept to manifest our desires more effectively? The key lies in understanding that by changing our perception of time, we can affect our reality. For instance, if we view our goals as already achieved in the eternal now, moment we align our psychological state with our desires, effectively pulling the experiences from the realm of possibility into manifested and perceived reality. This alignment can dramatically alter our approach to goals, making them feel more immediate and achievable, and we'll go over exactly how to do that in just a moment. First, let's go back to the question that I asked at the beginning of this video as a means of offering you a way to change your perception of how time works so that you can fully integrate this concept into your consciousness. The question was, have you ever not noticed that time seems to fly by when you're having fun, but seems to drag on when you're bored or during less pleasant experiences? This phenomenon is a form of temporal distortion, where our perception of time changes based on our emotional state. You can also notice this in the way that a Saturday might feel different to you than a Monday, or how an eagerly awaited vacation can seem to arrive more slowly than a routine week at work. It's all based on our meaning and the emotional state that corresponds to that. So it's an internal job. It's created within rather than without. By consciously managing our emotional responses and maintaining a state of joy and abundance in our present moment, we can actually speed up the manifestation process, making it feel as though it's happening faster. This is because feeling joy shifts our inner state to resonate with the experiences that we desire, effectively pulling our future goals into our present reality. 
This approach works because when we embody the emotions and the attitudes of what is considered the future version of ourselves, who already has achieved our goals, we begin to merge with that version. This alignment not only makes us a better match for what we want, but also speeds up our transformation, making the shift to our ideal self seem more immediate and real. But the kicker is that we must practice this alignment in the present moment. The only moment that truly exists by doing so, we remove the notion that our fulfillment, our manifestation, and our achievement are always in the future or are distant places that we need to reach, inviting us instead to experience them right now in the present moment. Only by engaging and existing in the present moment can we shape our future. So in the same way that you internally drag or speed up the clock based on what's happening on the perceived outside of you, which is really just based on the meaning that you're giving to that, you can also speed up the clock and bring what you call your future into the present moment by aligning your emotional state with a new meaning. The reality that you wish to create effectively living, as if your desired future is already your current reality, Quantum physics offers us a framework to understand how observing a possibility can bring it into reality by adopting a quantum mindset. We can recognize that all potential realities exist simultaneously in a superposition state. A superposition state basically just means that a particle can exist in multiple states at the same time until it's observed in easier terms. You can think of it like a coin spinning in the air while it's spinning. It's not just in one state heads or tails, but in both at the same time. It's only when the coin lands or when we look at it that it chooses to be in one state or the other in the realm of personal development and manifestation. You can think of yourself as being in a superposition state of all the possible versions of yourself. You have the potential to be any version of yourself, and it's your actions, thoughts, mental imagery, meanings or beliefs, and most importantly, your dominant focus that determines which version you eventually become. Our focused attention and intention can collapse. The superposition into a single-lived reality, effectively choosing our path of manifested experience through the quantum field of all possibilities. If you want to learn more about how to harness your focus for manifestation, I created a video a couple of weeks ago about this that includes 11 powerful tips, and I'll leave a link to that in the description of this video. If you haven't seen it back to building on this idea, conscious time travel involves using our ability to vividly imagine or remember events to influence our present thoughts, emotions, and vibrations. By revisiting past successes in our minds, we can harness the feelings of success and confidence that they bring up, empowering our present selves on the same token by pre-desired future events with intense emotional clarity. We can begin to attract these experiences into our lives, bridging the gap between now and then through our emotional and vibrational state. This mental time travel does not just revisit or anticipate experiences, but plays active role in selecting and realizing the version of ourselves that we aim to manifest, much like determining the outcome of the spinning coin when it finally lands to practically apply the process of using time jumping for manifestation. The best way to do this is through daily meditations and hypnosis sessions that focus on feeling the emotions associated with desires as already fulfilled. Visualization practices can also be powerful, where we not only see the outcome, but also embed that outcome within a temporal context that feels immediate and real, because I believe these are the most powerful ways to shift reality I have. Multiple meditation and hypnosis sessions on this channel for just this purpose. And I even created one just to collapse time that I posted last week. I'll leave links in the description of this video if you're interested in trying one or more of those out. And you haven't seen them yet to delve deeper into the concept of time as a non-linear malleable aspect of our exist. Let's explore how the analogy of the self... Being not just an object within the universe, but the actual universe itself can alter our awareness and understanding, as well as our practice of manifestation. 
this shift in perception can profoundly influence how we perceive our ability to navigate time and space for manifesting desired outcomes in our lives. So let's try a little exercise to expand the self. Beyond time and space, imagine for a moment that you are not just a passive participant traveling through time and space, but that you are actually time and space itself. This concept goes beyond the idea of being connected to everything. It's about actually being. Everything unfolds within you and also around you all at the same time. The universe with all of its potential timelines and events exists within you. Your consciousness doesn't just experience the universe. It is the universe it creates and influences it. We aren't often taught that this is the case. So let's see if we can make it a little easier to comprehend this. Rumi stated, you are not a drop in the ocean. You are the entire ocean in a drop. Your individual experiences are important, but you are larger than your individual experiences. All experiences exist within you and are accessible by you when your consciousness is focused in the direction of them. In other words, you can float your consciousness to any part of the entire ocean, which is actually all a part of you to access a new experience. By embracing this larger perspective, you can begin to understand that any limitation that you perceive such as time is a self-imposed constraint within your universal play. Once you've grasped this, you can begin to visualize the universe as a field where every point in space and time is accessible to you right now. All things exist. Now all things are accessible. And then visualize that you are this entire universe. If the ocean analogy works better for you, stick with that. Either way, when you view yourself as the universe, or as the ocean, every point in space and time is inherently a part of you, and you can move your consciousness piece to any point not by traveling in the conventional sense, but by shifting your focus and your consciousness attention. This shift allows you to experience different realities and possibilities instantaneously, without the linear progression of time. This concept can be applied through a technique often referred to as quantum jumping or dimensional jumping, where you envision yourself stepping into a different reality where your desires are already fulfilled. Here's a very simple way to practice this. Visualize a doorway. Picture a doorway that leads to a parallel dimension where your desired outcome is currently a reality. This doorway represents your ability to cross between different points in space and time. Step through it mentally. Step through this doorway with the full belief and emotional intensity that on the other side, you are living the reality that you wish to manifest. Then you're going to experience and embody it once you've made it through the doorway. Take a few moments to fully experience and embody the feelings and sensations of this reality. Notice the details, feel the emotions and the state of being that accompany this existence. Attempt to hold on to that state as long as possible and even bring it back with you into your daily life experience in the present moment. This might take a little practice, but it's well worth training yourself to do it by seeing yourself as a limitless quantum being. You acknowledge that all possible versions of yourself exist simultaneously across different timelines. This quantum version of you is not bound down by linear time, but experiences life in a multiverse of possibilities. This is how this information has reached you at this particular point in space and time. Although it's already all happened before, and each decision and intention that you set now can be seen as choosing which quantum path to follow, which reality to bring into focus, and live in the now moment. So instead of seeing time as a limiting factor that dictates how and when things happen, you can begin to view it as a tool that you can use to construct the reality that you desire. Time can be bent, stretched, or compressed in your conscious experience, altering how you perceive progress and manifestation. This fluid approach allows for the immediate realization of goals and dreams in your subjective timeline as time conforms to your will and your vision. So here's a brief outline of how this works. You hold a desire and intentionally choose a specific point in time and space where this outcome exists. Visualize it clearly as your current reality. Embody this reality in the present moment through daily meditation or focused visualization. 
affirming its existence with certainty and gratitude. Soon with practice, it becomes a naturally ingrained part of you, and as you naturally detach from specific expectations about how and when it materializes, because in your mind it already has, you should be able to easily maintain a state of alignment with this chosen reality. By continuously living as if it's already true, with this type of practice, you're able to maintain this state mainly because it feels good to do so, and because with repetition, you've created the neural pathways that say this is true, this consistent embodiment accelerates the manifestation process. Integrating it seamlessly into your life as a manifested experience, and I know this because I've done it many times myself in my own life, and because I've taught many other people how to do the same. The eternal moment of now is not just a point in time, it's a realm of limitless possibilities. Our challenge and our opportunities lie in using our consciousness to navigate this realm, selecting the experiences that we desire to bring into our reality. Harnessing this power can not only change how we perceive time, but also how how we experience life and manifest our deepest desires. So understanding that you actually are the universe and that all of time exists within you empowers you to navigate life with UNP paralleled freedom and creativity. This wisdom imparted by what you may consider your future self in the now. Moment underscores that whatever you put your attention and intention on consistently will take form as the constraints of linear time begin to dissolve. You start to live in a state where every moment is right, with the potential for any possibility that you choose to manifest by expanding your conscious awareness and embracing your role as the creator of your universe. You can use the concept of time not as a barrier, but as a powerful tool for shaping your reality. And this shift in perception offers a path to live life in its fullest expression, unbound by any limitations.